Oh yeah, one last thing, um, also in regards to the stay-at-home orders, since today's the last day the hair salons will be open, I'm actually getting my hair maintained, and, um, because it's been almost three months, so I just want to be good for the next three months, which will likely constitute the extensions of the stay-at-home order, if that is ever warranted. Just want to make sure I have it out of the way first. And then tomorrow we're going to put this dust together. So, yeah. So. so, it is the next night now. I got my hair done, as always. You might probably only... Let me turn the light on, actually, this one. There you go. That's better. Decided to get it done before the stay-at-home order went into effect. Again, it will be in effect by the time you see this video. In fact, it just went into effect about, like, five or so hours ago. So... Because that pretty much, um, with that pretty much putting all, um, all my 2020 travels to an end, and 2021 will be coming soon, um, but, um, there is a way I'm going to be keeping busy during this part of the lockdown, aside from some other stuff that will be coming soon. We got a box, and we're about to open it. Actually, this should be a bit easy to open, actually. Let me adjust this. Ugh. I don't know if you can see, but in there, that is the desk that we're going to be putting together. Again, time lapse will be in the next video because I don't have time. Ugh. And in case you guys are wondering what Black Friday looked like, here are some pictures right about now. And then we'll wrap up this video. Alright everybody, here is what Black Friday looked like. First off, we have this little kitten over here. And then the next one after this kitten statue, I shot this. Um, Homeless Where My Heart Is, Work Hard. It's very inspirational. And this is over at Macy's Backstage, which is always the first store I go to. Um, although I would go to JCPenney after that. Um, this is a little more of a Christmas tree um, fragrance, like an aerosol. I did consider getting it, but, um, decided not to because, um, I ended up getting something else. And there was a little, a little tiny mirror in there, and I decided to do a little mirror photo on there. And uh, masks are still required. Uh, I just want to put that out real quickly, just if anybody wants an update on that situation. And then next up we have a snow globe that has the Eiffel Tower. Um, of course, like, Paris. And then as I left Macy's, um, there is a sad, vacant storefront waiting for a new, a new store. Um, don't know what it's going to be yet. But I can tell that this was a recent vacancy. Um, next I went to JCPenney and I got a couple new things. I got a couple new t-shirts and a new pair of sweatpants and a new pair of shorts for like activewear. And then I found this crazy Nike tee that had like a lot of nationalities on it as far as like flags. There was like a maple leaf, there was some tricolors and other things. And then I went to Bath and Body Works after that because I, we needed some hand supplies. Um, and I took a picture of the H&M store across the, the mall. And that was my Black Friday experience. Um, very not so crowded than last year because of COVID. But um, I just want to say this. It looked totally different this year. There was, it was like deserted on a day when usually it is very crowded and it brings in like the most amount of sales for pretty much any tenant in any mall. So, with that said, I'm going to go ahead and wrap up this video. There will be no term of the week because I'm just a bit busy because I have to put together the assembly video for the desk that is next week and then a huge video in regards to well watching because we're coming up on the four year anniversary of that. And I'm going to remake one of my early videos that I put up on this channel. So, super busy time for me. 
Uh, with that said, though, um, thank you guys so much for watching, and we'll see you guys next video.